Hello all, welcome to this session of OpenMentor.net on C language. In today's session we are going to talk about variables and uh, data types. First of all we need to look at a placeholder. A variable is something that holds a value in memory at runtime. A variable lives as long as the program runs. It is in memory, it is not stored in disk. So variable is on memory and not on disk. This is the first thing. Data type means in our day to day life we are dealing with numbers, we are dealing with uh, strings which are alphabetic or alphanumeric characters. So basically C provides two important things to deal with numbers as well as strings. To define a variable first you need to give a data type then a variable name. For example if I say uh, character char, this is a reserved word, character c and then semicolon. This means c is the name of the variable, character is the data type of the variable. So this character has got, is, it will be holding one byte, okay, which is just eight bits. This is a basic data type. So it can hold only one ASCII character. It can be either a number or, a, or an alphabet or any punctuation mark also. It's just one byte of information which is 8 bits. Now this variable name can contain underscores but it has to start with alphabetic. The next variable type is something called int. If you say int for a, and I say uh, my var. You can use underscores within that variable. It can be up to 31 characters in length, but the first must be an alphabet. I can also use my var 1, something like that, but the first character must always be an alphabet. So int, depending upon machine to machine, usually this int is 16 bits, which is uh, 2 bytes. It may change from machine to machine. In some implementation they used only uh, one byte, but in most cases it is uh, two bytes. Okay. The next thing, this is this int will always have whole numbers. It will not have a decimal part. If I want to store a decimal part, then I need to use a data type called a float. Okay. Float is something like F1. This host, this is float is called a single precision floating point which is real numbers. This is uh, 4 bytes or in other words 32 bits. It can hold up to 32 bits. It can hold up to 7 or 8, I think 7 decimal points into that. If I want further more precision after the decimal point how many digits I need to store I need to use something called a double. Double if you if I use this one then this is 8 bytes internally the program will allocate 8 bytes in memory 8 bytes which is 8 into 8 64 bits it this is double is called a double precision float is called a, a single precision okay the single precision uh, word okay float is a double precision so these are the basic types Apart from this, there is something called short, long, and then signed and unsigned. We will talk about that a little bit later. Okay? To first understand char, int, float, double. So how do I uh, initialize these variables? It's very simple. C equal to any character you need to use single quotes, uh, within single quotes you need to use. So it can have only one value in that, one byte into that. So C equals within single quotes x. Then I say my underscore var1 equal to so 15. It's a whole number. Then floating point f1 equal to 15.327. You can sh you can use that one. And then d1 equal to 18.78906789. So you can use a lot more uh, precision into that. Now if I compile this, what happens? Let us check that out. Okay. It has no problems. It compiled and ran no, without any issues. I did not print it, but these are all the basic stuff. Char, int, float and double. Other varieties are there. 
we will see those advanced types uh, for example something called long double we, we will see that a little bit later but be clear that the variable name must start with an alphabet it can have underscore or no other punctuations allowed it can have numbers also it can have maximum 31 characters characters must have single quotes integer variables must not have a decimal point single precision can have up to seven digits in after the decimal point double precision can have up to 15 uh, digits after the decimal point so these are all the basic stuff in C variable definitions and uh, the data types thank you